Hi, my name is Amanda Steinberg and I am the founder and CEO of DailyWorth.com. We are a free daily email about money management specifically designed for women. And we're here to really help you understand what it means to build net worth and to create financial accountability and security for yourself. The reason I started Daily Worth really actually dates back to when I was two years old and my parents got divorced. And I saw firsthand as a very young girl what it was like for my mom, who had never worked before, to think about what it meant to be alone taking care of three young girls. So one of the lessons that she taught me at that time was to be financially independent. What I joke is she doesn't realize she created a maniacal entrepreneur in the process. In my 20s, I became very good at making money as a website engineer, building websites for other people. But at the same time, I also became great at spending all of that money. So when I was 30 and I bought a house and I was unable to make the mortgage payments despite making many hundreds of thousands of dollars a year, I asked myself, what's wrong? Why haven't I created the financial independence that's always been so important to me? So I started Daily Worth because I wanted to learn about money and there was really nothing out there from Kiplingers to Barron's to the Wall Street Journal that really understood where I was at and the questions I had about money. And honestly, I found them a little boring. So my whole objective in starting Daily Worth was to find a way to give money advice to women in a way that doesn't bore you to death. In the three years that I've been running DailyWorth.com, I've been able to grow our daily email subscribership to a readership of 250,000 women daily. How is it that I've been able to do that? Really, it comes down to the fact that I'm a weaver. How am I a weaver? I am able to not focus on my own strengths in each area of the business, but finding great people who are able to do sales, who are able to do editorial, who are able to do marketing, and weaving their strengths together to create an unbelievable team. Really, what is it that I focus on? I focus on revenue. I focus on sales. I focus on raising capital. I basically focus on making sure that we have enough money to pay all of the great people that we have hired so that they can weave their strengths and talents together to make a great company. Why are women so interested in this concept of balance? Why is it something that we strive for? Is it as if it's this aspiration that suddenly we will feel at peace when we achieve this balance? I actually think it's kind of a scam. And I think we're sold it to think that we somehow need to be passive, aligned. I don't know what it is. But I have to tell you that. Every successful woman that I know, I don't think she became successful and fulfilled and satisfied in her life pursuits because she was striving for balance. I think the conversation really needs to shift. I think maybe we need to eliminate this language altogether. I mean, really, is it ultimately serving us? Yes, we want to be rested. Yes, we want to spend time with our kids. But if we come up with this kind of hypothetical construct of what balance looks like, are we then always failing when we don't achieve it? Because life is full of constant curveballs. So why not create a new vernacular around what our ideals are around satisfaction? Let's not talk about balance. Let's talk about living life full tilt. Let's talk about living into our passions and our dreams. Let's, let's say, you know what, I am, I'm going to miss dinner tonight, but then I'm going to take work off tomorrow to be with my kid. That's, that's what I do. And I have to tell you, it's working far better for me than stressing about how much sleep I'm getting or not getting because I am living my life on all cylinders and it's working. So what's next for Daily Worth? What's next for Daily Worth is the launch of Create Worth, our twice weekly email edition about entrepreneurial finance geared to women. Why are we starting this? It turns out that women own 33% of the businesses in the United States, but we only account for 4% of the revenue. We bet that there are a lot of women out there who have greater ambitions than what they're achieving. It's our opinion at Daily Worth that part of what's holding women back is their understanding the, the financial side of entrepreneurship. So you can sign up for Create Worth at createworth.com and learn about everything from how to sell, what's a profit margin, what does a financial model look like. If you are passionate about being an entrepreneur, you have to understand what these concepts are about. So I invite you to sign up, Create Worth. Thank you.